up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Fabrizio Verdun and the former Pride champion, the Croatian, Merko Kroka. Fabrizio Verdun, Merko Kroka. Here we go. Tonight's fight is scheduled for three five-minute rounds. One of the things that Mirko Krokop does not get enough credit for is his great takedown defense, because if he does get taken down, then he can't showcase his spectacular striking skills. Yeah, he has really evolved um, in, in that respect. And, you know, another thing that he doesn't get enough credit for is the fact that he is probably the first guy who's a legitimate world-class striker that entered into the sport of mixed martial arts. And, uh, you know, that showed a lot of courage at the time. Those strikers like the Ernesto Hoos and the Jerome the Banners, all those guys that were at the top of the heap in K1, they were staying outside of MMA and just watching. And uh, Krokop was the first one to dive right in. He lands a head kick. What a jab. Big combination. Oh! Look at that. Oh, my. This could be it. Oh, big left. He's got a guillotine. He escaped the guillotine. Nice hip toss for the takedown. Oh, that's an outstanding transition. Wow, John, a lot of Fabrizio Verdun fans in the crowd tonight. Krokop with a strong switch kick. Both men landing in that exchange. Oh, that's a big head kick. Oh, that caught him. Solid shot to the body. Oh, stunning jab. Great head oh, kick. Big combination. Oh, there it is. oh, look at that. He is going after it here. Oh, did he snap that kick? They are really battling for position in the clinch. Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. Ten seconds. Single, five minutes in the books. Round one complete. Ready to fight? Ready. Round two. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he's left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. He blocks the punch. Krokop's right eye is looking pretty swole. Good combination. Beautiful right hand. That's a vicious kick to the body for Verdun. Krokop with a nice punch. Quick slip of the right. Swing and a miss with the big right. Joe, there we see our total strikes landed. He avoids damage with the nice block. Lands a hard kick. That's a big right hand. He connects with the left. Oh, oh. combination. Big shots. Strong jab. Oh, and another one. That hurt him. Oh, he's going for it here. Flying knee. Hard straight punch. Wow. Boom, big uppercut. Body kick, look at that. Oh, and he lands the head kick. Uh oh these are big strikes. Hard straight punch. Oh, 
he's landing. Oh, that one hurt him. Big kick just missed. They are exchanging here, Mike. Krokop gets caught by the head kick. Oh, big head kick again, Joe. Flying knee! Solid jab. Vicious shot to the body. He hurt him with that hook. Oh, he rocks him. Unbelievable. Oh. And it's all over. And it's all standing. Fabrizio Verdu. Just like that. Huge hook that got him the victory. Joe, here's the finish on our fight replay. And let's take a look at the replay. This is the shot that drops him. Perfect technique. He's clearly hurt badly here. Let's take a look at it from another angle here. This is the one that causes the knockdown and the subsequent follow-up strikes for the knockout. Great angle here. Boom! And then he's out. Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 19 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Fabricio Fabricio.